Greetings and welcome to this brand new video. We have a brand new version for Live Container right here with the multiple features and bug fixes. Live Container is completely free and it works without a jailbreak. You can run iOS apps without installing them and there is no three app limit. We are at the official GitHub page for Live Container and in this update video, we will take a look at its latest version and see what it offers. Now, if you go to releases, we have the latest version here. You can see that we have the new multitasking feature, which allows you to run apps in windowed mode. You can even have the new picture in picture mode with iOS 26 liquid glass support. And we have some improvements and bug fixes listed right here. As you can see right here, I have already made a complete guide on how to install and use live container. And it is confirmed working on iOS 26.0 or later also. You will find the guide in the description. Also, if you want a fresh guide for iOS 26, you can write that in the comments and I will do it for you. Now let's see how we can use the new multitasking feature of live container as you can see i am indeed on ios 26 and i have already installed size store if you don't know how to install size store you can install it by following the guide from the description again if you want a fresh guide for ios 26 let me know in the comments first of all we will open safari and head to the same official github page for live container scroll down to releases and from there get the latest IPA for live container. As you can see, I already got the live container IPA. Open side store, hit the plus icon, then select the live container IPA. You will see this dialog. Make sure you hit keep app extensions. All right, as you can see, it is now installed. Go back, open it. First of all, if you want to use it with the JITless mode, you will have to go to settings and patch side store. It will be an automatic process and then you will simply import the certificate from side store. You can see this will work with any normal Apple ID. Now to install apps, simply hit this plus button, install IPA, then select the IPA. I will select another one. All right. Now you can simply hit the run button to run them. But if you want to multitask, simply press and hold, then go to settings, then hit convert to shared app, then hit move. I will do the same with the second app. Go to settings, convert to shared app. Now to multitask, you can simply press and hold and then hit multitask. And you can see it is now in the windowed mode. You can reduce its size and it will adopt it automatically. You can set the scale. You can enable PIP. Let's do it with the second app. Press and hold multitask. And you can see it works fine. We are running two apps simultaneously in the windowed mode. Now to enable liquid glass support for live container, go to settings, scroll all the way down to apps, scroll down and then select live container. And then from there, you can enable liquid glass support. Now open multitasking and simply quit out of live container if it was open. Open it again and you can see we now have the new liquid glass support enabled for live container and it works flawlessly. That's all for this video guys. If you still have questions, please ask in the comment section and I will reply you as soon as possible. I will see you in a new video. Goodbye and take care of yourself.